<laughs> what the fuck did you guys drink at the show, man? Oh, I didn't take any one of those fucking samples. <laughs> Look at you, you're fucking whacked out, man. Bob Marley's looking for, your wife is looking for you, Bob Marley. <laughs> With the dreadlocks, you need some of that mellow drinking. You, you need, you need, you need to smoke some weed and get high and feel good. Go, uh, go get those corn dreads taken off the locks. He's on a roll. Just let it go. Corn dreads. I don't know what I took, what but. Mel saying his name was Jim was. You were sampling everything in that. <laughs> so, That's why you're all whacked out. <laughs> No, you, you sampled pre-workouts. There's a lot of caffeine in there. Well, that's why he's acting like. That. I'm surprised Branch Warren wasn't an honor to see Lord Vader. What did he say? He said he saw, he sees you on watches your shit. Yeah, he watches my set, but I'm surprised he gave me that smirk. Like, who the hell are you, you, you pansy? <laughs> what did you want him to do? Like a red bed over like Obama? Yeah, I, I would want him to bow like Shelly Baba. You're a god to the fitness community. <laughs> An absolute sis of gods to the fitness world. I pr I praise in your presence. Can I have your? Can I kiss your 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 chew? <laughs> <laughs> And your wife and your wife too can kiss my shoe as well. <laughs> you're a big talker when you're not right in front of the fucking guy, right? Now when you see him later, you're gonna say all that stupid shit. <laughs> no. Tonight we are in Port Charlotte Harbor. Don't stop. Because soon she'll be in Delray. She'll be in Delray <laughs> with Big Lenny. She'll Yesterday's gone. Show. Yesterday's gone. Get in the car, you fucking idiot. Andrew and Brad, Grayson and Emma coming over for dinner in Natasha and Big Lenny's house. Oh, yeah. Eating steak and talking to the kids. Emma holding the babies. Yesterday's gone. Three hundred and thirty pound freak, Big Lenny, the biggest freak in Port Charlotte Harbor, hit town. <laughs> I fucking can't. What's up with those cookie cutter T-shirts? Big Lenny's here, and your cookie cutter hat on backwards, and your sunglasses, Mr. Cool. Are you the finest specimen? What about Christina Prokofiev? Has gone. she been replaced? No, no, no. What's up with that cookie cutter hairstyle on the front and them orange cookie cutter shirts? Is this what Port Charlotte has to offer? A cookie cutter town? How dare you respect Big Lenny? You knew I was coming. You're wearing those cookie cutter shirts. Where's Hogan? Hogan, I'm gonna break you in half tonight, buddy. Now I'm gonna smack that bird. I'm gonna <laughs> Lenny, like a bird. You might want to get out of the street, Lenny. Brad, do you have a taser? Did you bring a taser with you? I usually do have. Oh, I forgot. Tasers don't work on Lenny. Oh, yeah. Natasha, how about if I jump off that building for you? This is for you, Natasha. Mel Chauncey, you look like a fucking bird. That's how you look like one that fucking freak. Now stay into his face so we can watch him. Watch him. Why did you color your hair on the front like a cookie cutter? Why? Get out of the road and get in the van. What kind of Lenny, stop twitching. Lenny, Lenny. Yeah. Knock it off. 
Get in the fucking van. Hi, I got a special treat for you, Misfit Maniacs. We're at Mel's oh show tonight, live. And I got a friend, Lou D'Onofrio. Like he said it. <laughs> known Lou for 20 years. He trained with me and Andrew Kalora. Well, if you want to. You but you Lou, his last name. he would go off on people in the gym. You get in his face or whatever. A guy had gloves on. He heard across the gym screaming. I guess he grabbed a weight. Lou had. He says, get the fuck away from me. He goes, who the fuck in this gym wears gardening gloves? So me and Kalora, being the troublemakers we were, sometimes Lou would do an intense set. Hulk Hogan, Hulk Hogan. Get him, get him, get him, get him, Hulk Hogan. Oh shit, yeah. We got Lou over here. Oh, man, you could have done Well, you're bigger than him. Oh, man. He looked like, anyways, an old, anyways, he looked like an old, decrepit old man coming in there. Lenny. How long have I known you, seriously? Almost 20 years. And Lou's actually Where'd gotten bigger. Where did you meet me? World Gym, Delray. World Gym and Delray. The old the World Gym. gym. The original. The real, who, who won that gym? Jim Willard. Jim Willard. And the girl you used to date. The Who's loveliest the hottest girl ever. Sherry Lee. <laughs> and who dated her? Not only that, but you used the gummy bears on her, which we'll, that's all we'll talk about. <laughs> oh, yeah. But we, we, what we do, me, Kalora, we'd, we'd try to get under his skin or whatever. And Lou would look at us, he'd do his set, he'd come up and give us both a double finger, which nobody big that then. <laughs> so we, we, we thought we'd have some fun with it. So we go up to people, like a big guy or whatever, and we say, hey Lou, this guy said you got a problem with pissing to people. So Lou goes, why not parking lot? Didn't know the guy. He goes, hey. He goes, you got a problem with me pissing to people? I was like, what are you talking about? Whatever. And he knew we put him up to it. As you can see, Lou's gonna do the over 50, what is that, in two years? Yeah, I'm gonna compete for Try it for now, and modest to God, the biggest guy here, and obviously the biggest arms, most density, there's Lou. Many years of heavy lifting and eating. I don't know, man, Len Lenny's, been a, Len Lenny's been around a long time, and Lenny's a good guy. Sometimes he loses his mind on his fin of a butt, or whatever. Yeah, but sometimes you gotta be, you gotta get your name on the map, like Lou's got Divine Nutrition, a few other ventures. He's doing very successful. Very good businessman. He's a Trump man, by the way. Trump. Made all his money on his own. <laughs> so we'll see, hopefully, you know, everything will be all right, but. Lenny got a girlfriend, by the way. Or Lenny got a girlfriend. He met a girl today here in uh, Port Charlotte. She's gonna be my and wife. he's gonna marry her. Natasha. And he's gonna get rid of both. What's the other Mathis. one's name? What's the girl's name? Don't Which one? Me. What's her name? Don't well, Christina me. wasn't necessarily <laughs> a girlfriend. Oh, uh, no, yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> Christina is like, a goddess, a spiritual goddess. He proposed to her after we ate lunch. Yes. Never, Christina was never like that. She was still is the goddess and my inspiration, but for a wife I've met her. Her name is Natasha Mathis. She, no, she, Lenny, just <laughs> Mathis. be just be happy she got your order right. <laughs> really. There's more to it than that. I know it when I see it. When you know it, you gotta go with it. Jason! Jason, what was the first thing? What was the first thing you said to me when you met me? Do you remember? I do. You said you had bigger calves than me. Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you want to Jason, calves? where'd Hulk Hogan go? I want to get Hulk They whisked him, he walked through here and they whisked him back there. Go, go yeah. back there, Jason. Just go back there. No, I'm not allowed. Yeah, you're, you're an you internet celery. Yeah, now. fuck it. You're not gonna let me go back there, man. What are you scared of? It's you, man. I get kicked out, man. So they'll just put you back out past the drapes so and they don't want you back there. Maybe he'll be happy to see you. I think he knows about you. I have a VIP pass. Why can't I go back there? Go ahead. Go walk back there. Am I allowed to? Do whatever you want. You're VIP. That's right. You're an internet celery. Yeah. Well, I'm not allowed back there. I don't know if I'm allowed back there. Yeah. Yeah. Let's get they got some pizzas back there set up. Who say you go back there? No. Is there a way we can sneak back there? Can you ask him, please? Look at you about to cry. Mail. Can you ask him, please? Get this on tape. Come on, get it. Get it. Come on, get it. <laughs> Let me get it high, it still hurts. On YouTube, I'm on living here. Look at that. You know, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm Jason talking. Genova, YouTuber. Oh, make America piss again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. And I got my Order 66 t shirt from Star Wars. Strong, bro. Yeah. Misfit Mania. Look. 
you look in really good shape, man. Thank you, bro. You look awesome, dude. Can you give me, can you say a hell yeah, brother, to me? No, that's Stone Cold. That's his gimmick. What's your gimmick? Say, say, say. My gimmick? Well, you're not old enough to know my gimmick, but my gimmick is, hey, brother, what you gonna do, brother? <laughs> that's what my gimmick is. <laughs> oh, that's great. Yeah, yeah. I remember your TV show, Hogan Knows Best. That yeah. was a great TV show. Yeah, that was fun. That was fun. Great. You got a picture of them? I don't have to take a picture. Take a picture. Man, hold on, brother. I, it, the rules are a breath and a sip of beer in between pictures. No, it doesn't. My guess is the most. My bad is just like a big thing. What are we doing now? Yeah, take a picture, please. Misfit Mania meets Hulkamania. Look at that How are you doing? Lifetime Hulkamaniac. Squares trading in vitamins. This is what you get, Big Lenny. This Big Lenny, I feel safe, brothers. <laughs> Big Lenny Mania. Don't you touch a hair on my chinny chin chin because this is what you're gonna have right here. That's right, Dale. The case of Dale. Oh, let's get Dale, brother. Hold on, brother. Uh oh, we're gonna get Dale. 